When you can't make sense of the world today Ask Mr. Jordan to show you the way On the Birds and the BS Morning everyone and welcome to the Birds and the BS where we encourage you to actually take the advice you give your children. Today's letter comes from Allie in Alabama. Dear Mr. Jordan, my son is always playing with his gum and spitting it on the floor, so I've made a no gum in the house rule. My daughter says she always uses her gum responsibly, so it's still her right to chew. Should I let my daughter keep her gum? Hmm, Allie, let me use an analogy to help with this one. Imagine for a moment that I am surrounded by people who play with their gun. With these people spitting bullets all over, would my mother still let me keep my gun? Here to answer that question is my favorite mother from live musicals on TV, Anna Gasteyer. Thank you for having me, Jordan. Sit up straight, you look like Shikard Quasimodo. Um, if I were using my gun the right way, but others weren't, would you still let me keep mine? Of course not. But I didn't do anything wrong. It's a fair point you make. This was not your mistake. I'm a law-abiding son. Why take away my gun? But as a mother in charge of your fun, the ex of another can ruin it for everyone. And that's because, as you always say, This is why we can't have nice assault weapons or, you know what, guns of any kind. When it comes to our kids, it's time for us to step in instead of think and pray for peace of mind. Government says sacrifices sometimes should be made in the name of the greater good. Someone tainted Tylenol, they fixed the flaw. There was one shoe bomb, and they changed the law. And when guns kill kids, that's the final... Second Amendment. Ah, that's exactly what they always do. They shoot us down by invoking the Second Amendment. Don't they understand how much there is to lose? There are lives at stake, and don't forget who. Nothing's more important than the safety of a child So time to take your guns And the rhetoric is stockpiled Whoa, that's pretty radical Most of us are against assault weapons But even we liberals can't go after the Second Amendment itself Why not? I mean, we just don't It's always, look, we're not saying we're coming for your guns Actually, now we are Wait, really? Mm. This is why we can't have compromise I understand you think that hunting's neat But sometimes our pastimes jeopardize Our lives which matter more than your precious skeet I understand you really had a ball Then one lone wolf went and ruined it all And by one I mean 96 deaths a day so even though there are a lot of people who use guns responsibly, the fun we get to have with them isn't worth the destruction they cause? Exactly. You know, there's a lot of things we do that with. Like lawn darts, uh -huh. Sudafed, and adopted animals are harder to get than a gun because of the actions of a few. Exactly. But what about safety? And guns for protection? Allow me to issue a logic correction. A gun beneath your pillow makes you feel secure. Till you think your granny's a burglar, then it loses its alarm. They say a good guy with a gun could stop a bad guy with a gun. But neither has to die if neither one has one. I only wonder how these men will find their sense of self-worth and masculinity without their pew pew. Who you are as a man isn't found in your gun. And who we are as a country should be safe for everyone. Australian stay butch after their overhaul. So if you're a macho prick, you can stay one after all. Take us home! This is why we can't have Rambo teachers. This is why we can't have dummy leaders. This is why we can't have not nice things. And when the government needs to be overthrown Get, get your, your ass out and vote Cause we can do this alone That's all for today folks Allie, tell your daughter she can play with her bazooka gum all she wants As long as she joins the March for Our Lives And join us next time when we'll send our thoughts and prayers That Marco Rubio wakes up to find his balls between his legs Instead of his gun Till then This is why we can't have the Electoral College well, we figured that one out. Now be sure to share, subscribe, and comment. See you next time!